Smaller, how big the crowd? Same pair threes for the whole tour. Trap phone in the iPhone 4. Still got do all my old chores. Still cop squares from the old store. Hey. Hey, what's going on guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to install Call of Duty Black Ops 3 for free on the PC. So what you guys need to do is go to the description and download the files and then open uh, Cod BO Tree EXE and then you want to uh, put it wherever you want to install it. I'm going to put it in games, then click install and it should open uTorrent and um, wherever you guys want to uh, put it, you know, browse for games is where I put mine obviously and uh, as you see it's 39 gigabytes so it might take a while depending on your internet speed. Um, change your uh, bandwidth LX to high and it should download faster I'm not I'm not 100% sure but it should download faster anyway um, so once it's done downloading which it will take a while like I said you just want to open it and then you told me last you to continue uh, just click continue and then it should open a bunch of different installers just click the first one and um, the rest of them don't need to be opened so like I said click the first one and once that's done it will open another installer Alright, now once the installer is open, what you guys want to do is just browse for where you want to put it on one's at games and then click install. And once it's done installing guys, it will open another command prompt and once that command pro uh, prompt is open, it will open a few um, browser, uh, browsers as well, uh, just taking you back to the no steam website. Just X out them, they obviously open on my second screen, that's why you can't see them. And now you should see you have Black Ops 3 on your PC. You're not done quite yet, you're gonna have to open the COD fix and then uh, obviously that opens the installer for the patch and then you wanna find where your Black Ops 3 game is located at. Like I said, mine's in games and then Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Then you wanna click uh, continue and then install and it should install the patch onto obviously Black Ops 3. Now you're not quite done yet either. What you guys wanna do is open, obviously after this command prompt uh, says you're done, you wanna open the DLC too because without the DLC you cannot run the game. Um, Unfortunately, so I'll leave the DLC in the description also once you open that it should open a U-Torn It's only about 11 gigabytes, so it shouldn't uh, take as long as the, the game did to install so uh, Once that's done it will download another installer and um, Thankfully the installer does everything for you. You don't have to manually drag the files into your directory like you would black ops 1 in my other video um, but uh, yeah, hopefully this won't take too long. Obviously, I'm not going to put the full thing in the video, but once it's done, you want to open that and then open the application as well. For some odd reason, this took a long time to open, so I had to obviously uh, cut it out. But once it opens, um, you click on browse and you find where Black Ops 3 is located at. Um, for me, obviously, mine was located in games, so browse um, and then you want to find where yours. Some people do it on their desktop, some people on a different hard drive or whatever, wherever you want to put it totally up to you it doesn't change anything but like I said mines in games and then once you click on black ops 3 click ok then install now this has three parts to it so it shouldn't take too long but once it's done what you guys want to do is go to your black ops 3 directory and you should see you have a zombies loader uh, multiplayer loader uh, I think it's nightly loader and free run loader. So if you want to load free run, click free run loader. If you want to load multiplayer, multiplayer loader and zombies, zombie loader. So I'm going to test this out on zombies for you guys. And unfortunately my PC is dog shit. So the graphics are going to look totally fucked and it's going to be very, very laggy. Unfortunately, I'm sorry about that. Um, I think it's not opening the game. But I kind of want to make this look legit as possible because some people are going to be skeptical unless, but you know, as if this works or not. And I want to show you guys as much proof as possible that this does work. Um, I wouldn't be making a video if it doesn't because there's always going to be people in the comment section saying this is um, a virus or it doesn't work. But I want to show you guys as much proof as possible because this does work and you can get Black Ops 1 multiplayer zombies and campaign and free run for free you don't need to buy the game of course I do always recommend buying the game because you know it's not as good as having uh, the real game but what you want to do say whatever you loaded multiplayer whatever just click on the free run um, and that's how you load into it so I click on free run and then I load into zombies or say if you loaded the multiplayer then click on free run and load into multiplayer I would show you that too but for the sake of the video I didn't want to make it too long so I just load into zombies as you know I like zombies a lot more than multiplayer but like I said guys the graphics are going to look totally fucked because my PC is complete garbage and I can't really do much about that. Hopefully I'll be upgrading in the next week or two. That is the plan and if that does go well and that you know goes to plan then I should have um, 
a good enough PC to be able to run this game. Uh, maybe not record it, but still, you know, even if we get to play the game, that'll be still pretty cool. So, like I said, guys, the graph is going to look totally shit. But that's it for me, guys. I hope you do enjoy this. If you're having any problems, please, please, please comment down below. Uh, my friend linked me to the download, so uh, I'd like to thank him for uh, showing me how to do this. I thought I'd make a video for you guys, so if you did enjoy, uh, leave a like on the video. That'd be very much appreciated, and like I said, the graphics look totally crap. But if you guys have a decent piece, see then um, of course you're gonna be able to play this game quite fine but unfortunately for me that's not the case anyway guys hope you have a good day and i will see you guys in the next one peace Stay positive and hope for the best I'm obsessed, I want it all, dog, and nothing less I'd rather be a dead man than to live with no success So I spit it from deep in my chest All of these inner feelings used to just keep them suppressed Then I wondered why the fuck I would be so depressed And I realized that I really just need to confess So when you hear me on a record, it's the real me I only do it for the people that can feel me And if you wanna hate, then go ahead and feel free But I'ma continue to do this